Hey guys, so I am actually on my way to get tested for Corona again. Taking my dad and Evan with me as well because um, we found out that like three people from Deja's birthday tested positive for COVID. So, um, I just want to be sure I can move. Um, even though I just got tested a week ago, her party was the day after my test. So, um, I guess in actuality, I could have been re-exposed. So, I am going to get tested again. Let's pray this time is negative as well, because <laughs> the last one was negative. Um, I don't have any symptoms. Um, I've had a cough since Mr.'s thing a little bit, but that's it. Oh, shoot. I shut the car off. Um, but that's it. So let's hope it's nothing making me a late breakfast anybody else love cream chip beef i love it and i have to have mine on soft white bread i don't want it toasted or nothing i want it nice and soft look at that uh oh, so good wants a brand new loaf of bread too so it's extra soft uh, i have to go in i went and got me some snacks <laughs> so i can have some uh some of the in the house snacks. Got some oranges and some fish and party mix. And these um ice cream bars. I gotta go put it in my freezer. It's like um uh oh these peppermint ice cream sandwiches. I can't wait to taste it. I'm also having some rum punch because there's some left. I need to drink it before it goes bad. <laughs> it's good the next day. Add more time to marinate together. So, yeah. Hey guys, happy Sunday. I've been holed up in my room for two days now. I got my email and voila, my test result is also positive. I have now caught the Rona. What? <laughs> Crazy, right? <coughs> I am, um, I can't even say I'm shocked though because, um, since Friday, more people have become positive that was at Deja's party. So, clearly, that room or somebody in that room started a nice little fire. <laughs> um, Cause Deja friend is positive. Deja is positive along with um, now myself and Kisha. Although her husband is negative, so that's good. Um, and another person I don't know if they would want me to give you their name or not. I haven't talked to her, so I'm not going to say that. But, um, yeah. So now I'm waiting for my son's results and my dad's results. Um, and so I guess now we just start the whole quarantine process. Although I've been in the house, but, um... It says that somebody from the public health will call me, um, and I have to call my doctor, which I'll do tomorrow. Um, when Deja got her results, um, on Friday, she, she talked to the doctor. He just told her to, you know, stay in, take some vitamins, um, and then, you know, keep track of temperatures and stuff. I've been taking my temperature since Friday. It's been normal. Um, I still have the same little cough that I've had, 
Um, and then I was like, well, maybe this was from that, you know, the first time I got tested, but that test came back negative. So I can't say that this is from two weeks ago, but who knows how it works. Um, but now I will isolate. I have masks for I go out my room and the rest of the house, make sure I'm masked up. Um, I need to get, I actually need to get some more cough syrup. Um, just figure out what's going on and how, what's the best way to go for it. I don't have any other symptoms. Um, I can still taste and smell. I did have like a, a little tight, but I don't think that's, I think that's all in my mind since I read the thing. Because I literally did not have it until I read the email. <laughs> so it's like all in my mind. And when she talked to her doctor and the baby's doctor, they said it's, it's fine for her to still breastfeed. She just has to wear a mask around the baby, <clears throat> which she's been doing. She's, I mean, she, she's been wearing her mask ever since she found out that her friend tested positive. Um, and while she was waiting for her results. And then as soon as she got the results, she went straight home and, like, has not left the house. So, I need to get some more supplies, I suppose. Some cough syrup and stuff. I think I might just order on Amazon or, um, Walmart delivery or something. Something like that. But, yeah, guys. I guess we're all gonna... Quarantine together. This is crazy. But you know what? It's like <laughs> Deja said she felt like we had one big orgy and now we all trapped in the closet like R. Kelly. <laughs> um you know, I guess the odds were against us from the gate, you know, we, we knew the risk and everybody wore masks, but there were, you know, moments of taking off the mask to sing and to eat and we were in this room no air circulating you know so um definitely we we put ourselves in that situation so now i'll just have to deal with it and um hopefully because i seem to be asymptomatic aside from the cough that it won't get any you know serious or anything like that so let's um put a prayer out there for us <laughs> I feel like I'll be asking for y'all for prayers every other day now but no I think so many more um you know with this second wave going the people are getting it and recovering from it um and it's not you know there's still definitely bad out there but there are people making full recoveries as well and that's the list we plan to be on I got to come outside my room. <laughs> Make you some tea. Hope that'll see some stuff. I know y'all got some. Who got the home remedies? Who got the. Look at this. Somebody made this for me a while ago. Um. Who got the tricks? Who got the COVID tricks? Hey guys, good morning. Happy Monday. Happy day four oh, of my quarantine. Um, I'm down downstairs, so I don't wear my mask anytime I'm out of the room now. I'm happy to report that. Uh, we got test results this morning for my dad and Evan, and they are both negative. So that's a good thing. And my mom is going to get tested. Um, but I think it's <laughs> it's just isolated to those of us that was at in that karaoke room um, that has been affected because one more person tested yesterday, tested positive. Um, that was also at karaoke. So, 
I think it's pretty safe to say that that's where this came from. Um, I'm doing okay today. I still have the cough. Um, I'm more in here. Like my throat is, um, it doesn't hurt. <coughs> Excuse me. My throat doesn't hurt. But it's, um, like right here and down to, like right in my chest. I'm aware. It's hard to explain. I was, um, I was telling Kisha I'm more conscious of the need to breathe. You know what I mean? So, like, I'm more like, okay, I can do it. I can breathe. <laughs> I was um, practicing my holding my breath. That's my niece, Care. She, um, she was like, you know, hold your breath for ten seconds, and that'll just trying to control your your breathing and stuff like that. Because um, she actually had coronavirus months and months ago. Maybe that was something that they told her. I don't know. I'm so. <coughs> excuse me. I'm supposed to get um, a phone call from somebody at Public Health. And I don't know if that's like the Delaware or the National or what. Somebody called me this morning from Ohio, but then they hung up on me. <laughs> um, I just called my doctor. We're going to do a, a follow-up televisit this afternoon. Um, so I just have to wait for him to call me. Um, I am making some hot tea. I did order last night off Amazon. I ordered some cough medicine. I got some Usinex, like daytime and nighttime. And I got some vitamins. Because that's what, um, my doctor, well, I have the same doctor as my daughter. And when she called and had her visit... That's what he told her to build up her immune system. Um, and I took some Tylenol last night. I was a little ache, like my back hurt a little bit. It was weird, but it could have been just from laying in the bed most of the day. Uh oh, my hot water. Um, so I was like, and then my, it was like my back and then my knee, but I'm like, my knee always hurts. So. I don't even think I should be able to put that in the category of uh, aching body parts because <laughs> that's just a given. So, um, that's what's going on today. I am going to make me some waffles and go back in my room. And, um, yeah, I'm going to get back to my quarantine it's funny how when you can't go nowhere that's when you feel like damn i'm stuck <laughs> i do need my oh, i really don't like cloth masks too much i need to send the boy out to my car i got um packs of disposable ones um you know, like that you want to do something, but you're like, they, they, they won't let me do nothing. And I want to rebel. I want to go somewhere. <laughs> no, that's not true. I got nowhere to go. Nowhere, except for Florida. And now that can't happen. So, today I'm also going to call Frontier and cancel our flights. And, um, I'm just going to save it for another time. Um, hey, maybe I'll even use mine for New Orleans in January. If we still get to go for, uh, momcation. You know, with everything going back to shutting down and stuff like that. Huh. You uh, never know what's going to happen, but I'm still hopeful. And as long as, because I know there's some people who have already booked their hotel and stuff. So as long as they're still going, then I'm going to still go. 
All right, I'll be back. Got my coronavirus starter kit. Big ass thing of women's multivitamins. I'm really thinking I should have got the gummies. I'm scared to open this. They just sound like they big horse pills. And I got some uh, vitamin D for uh, immune health. I remember, I know the doctor said to take vitamin C too and zinc. But I was like, I ain't buying all these damn things. They cost too much. <laughs> and I got some mucinex for my cough. So I got the uh, daytime and the nighttime. <laughs> I got this caution tape. I had a, I had a vision of putting the caution sign on my door so I could take a picture. What? Look at this. This is my son helping me make my thumbnail. And he's officially coronavirus free. So his his days of quarantine are over. He said he's going outside. That's so rude. I think he should stay in the house with his mom. This is four days. We got 10 more days of being in the house. <laughs> He's so rude. You gonna bring me something back? Yeah, I'll leave right here at the door. Damn. Maybe I should put a little table out there. This is so wrong. I got you. That's so sad. I got you. What are he doing? This is how petty. <laughs> what is that? I don't even touch the outside uh, door. You don't know. You never know. You might have sneezed on it by accident. Or I don't touch. <laughs> you know. Are you really spraying your hand? Oh my god. I. This is the love I get. Really. You won't get me. That is so sad. Hey guys, I'm back again. Stop it. <clears throat> Why do you keep sniffing me? Do y'all follow me on Instagram? <clears throat> if you follow me on Instagram, and you probably saw my story last night with her sniffing me and all up in my hair, and <clears throat> she was being so darn close. Stop it. Last night. And I was telling her I was going to take a picture, and she started messing with me. She'd be so close. Anyway, um, I'm about to end the vlog, but I wanted to show y'all. Um, <clears throat> more um stuff that this girl used to work with she wanted to uh, uh oh um make something for me so she made these plates isn't it cute um i thought that was nice <coughs> um these like charger plates and she got uh pictures and made that for me I thought that was really sweet. <clears throat> I'm feeling okay still. I am I am now uh, trying to talk less. Because now when I talk, it's almost like deja vu from last year. When I was really sick this time of year. I think I said this before, if y'all remember. When I was really sick and they didn't know what it was. Um, <clears throat> it was that whole upper respiratory thing <laughs> that everybody had. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure we all had that back then. But um, talking now, it gets to be work. <coughs> so I'm uh, trying to limit the amount of time that I talk. Um, also, does anybody know what the deal is with Corona and eating? Because let me tell you, I've been hungry today. Like... I ate breakfast, and then, like, two hours later, I had another breakfast. <laughs> and, um, now I'm hungry again. It's only, what time is it? It's, like, um, 2 o'clock. It's 2 o'clock. I mean, I guess because I didn't have lunch. But I'm not normally, like, oh, breakfast, lunch, you know, like, on time. I could go hours and hours without eating. But <clears throat> now I've just been feeling hungry. And I've been um, thirsty, too. I was really hot earlier. Um, I've calmed down now, but I've been drinking a lot of water. And I think I might be hungry because I've been using the bathroom a lot, too. I don't know if that's a symptom, either. Like, you get you get the bubble guts when you got the Rona? I don't know. But, um, <clears throat> so, I feel like 
what is it starve a fever but feed a cold so maybe the corona making me think i got a cold <laughs> um what else was i going to say oh i need some ideas to binge watch on netflix i just finished the crown the other day season four so good and now they're talking about season five not gonna come out till 2022 or some mess that is just horrible like i'm obsessed with the crown um but <coughs> then i <coughs> excuse me i watched the other day i'm tell you i watched <laughs> i watched a documentary on dolly parton and i watched um I think it was called Marching Orders, the thing about this marching band at the Dune Cookman College University. Um, I think that's what it's called. So I need something else to watch. What are y'all watching on Netflix? Let me know as I still have 10 more days of having to stay in the house. So I need something to watch. I'll be watching Friends. Uh-oh, my TV. <coughs> I be I watch Friends all day. Even now I've seen every episode of Friends twenty seven thousand times. But I need something else to watch. <laughs> um sorry, I thought I was about to cough. That's all I got for y'all. I will continue to update as the days go on. Um I don't anticipate anything exciting happening to be vlogging, but I will do some, you know, maybe some daily pop-ins of my, uh, what's been going on and how I'm faring with everything. So, I will keep you guys updated. If you are not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We are still on our way to 10,000 subscribers, so let's not lose our motivation. Um... We still got time. We got time to get there before December 31st. <laughs> That's only a month away, but we got time to get there. Um, hit that like button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.